Is the AP needed for college admission? Answer, no, nowhere. Not a single college requires the AP test. And they can't because too few students have an abundance of AP courses available to them. Even those in high schools that have lots, um, a lot of the students aren't encouraged to take those courses. And of late, the AP is hard to test if you aren't already in a course, you gotta go through some hoops. So, so few kids are in the AP stream in the first place that it'll be manifestly unfair to make admission to college to, to make it um, AP related. So here's why there's still an advantage to students who take the AP and get good scores, fours and fives. The AP is still an extra data point and colleges in the admissions offices like lots of data. They want to see meritorious things. And if they already like you a lot as a candidate in one thing, a good AP score can help reinforce their decision why to take you over some other candidates that they like. So AP is an informal criterion that's used if your scores are really good. If they're bad, I haven't heard of a single college that hurts you if you only get a one or a two on the AP. It's disregarded rather than regarded lowly. So I am of the opinion that Taking AP, if you're already in the course, makes sense. Taking a daunting course in school, just because it's labeled AP and then you take it, I don't think is a wise idea, unless you really like the course. But if it's gonna be a burden day in, day out, find another course or another teacher of the same course at a regular level. Now, if you go through those hoops, you can still sit for the AP and that could be as impressive then as a same score, four or five, without being in the AP course. At that point, the college, they're gonna see a score, probably don't care whether you took the course or took the AP without the course. If you want the easy way out, and easy way is not bad, there are sure sight tests. Now they've replaced the SAT subject test, those one hour versions of what you know. And in a lot of ways, they're better than the AP. So the more colleges that are accepting those, the better for you who studied a subject well and might not want to sit for a three hour subjective AP, which by the way, kind of costs a lot of money. Sure sight tests cost a lot less. Those sure sight tests are new. They have replaced the subject tests, which the college board took away. So you can look thesuresight.com and see what's available to you there.